So we've received an alert of a new patch update for Documentum server. Let's review the update process. On the screen, you can see that we can connect to Documentum Administrator running in the Kubernetes cluster from my Windows desktop. Let's log in. So here's the Documentum system information landing page. We have one doc base connected into the system. Uh, we have a doc broker. We have version 16.4.120.175 running on Linux CentOS in this case with a Postgres database. Uh, this repository has uh, an ACS, a branch office cache, all enabled. We can go and look at some of the functionality to show that it is running, that we can go into the system cabinets. Uh, we have uh, some storage in place. Some storage is already set up in the first file store. Uh, there's various different configurations that we can perform. Uh, we don't want to run through a demonstration of document administrator today. So let's go over to see what's inside the Kubernetes cluster that's supporting this setup. Here we are in the cloud shell of our Google Cloud Platform Kubernetes cluster. Just want to show you a little bit of what's inside. Here we have the Kubernetes command line to get all the pods inside of our demo namespace. We'll run that command. Here you have a listing of all the pods that have been deployed using the Helm charts. These pods contain our Documentum application containers. You can see that there's one pod each at the moment for this demonstration, very much just to show how the updates are occurring and we can get this demo done in the right amount of time. It takes about five minutes for a container to be updated inside of this system. You can see that all the pods are running. There's a number of restarts for some of our storage provisioning and you can see the age as well for the uptime. So with this command, we can list all of the Helm charts that are currently deployed. And here you can see a mapping from the pods to the actual charts, uh, very much one-to-one -one in this case, because we're using Helm charts to deploy all of our containers. We have the release name, we have the number of revisions. As you can see from the demo, we've been updating the content server released quite a bit. All of them are deployed. We have the actual names of the charts and the application versions as well. You can see under the app version for the Documentum server that we're running 0.175 for the patch update. And that's maps directly to the chart and maps directly to the version of the Documentum server reported by Documentum Administrator. What we want to do is update our Documentum content server release right there from 0175 to 0202. We've already updated the images within our container repository. We've already updated the Helm chart version number and we're ready to run our Helm chart upgrade command. Type the Helm upgrade command for our demo environment for our Documentum server release. And as easy as this, it'll go off, find the Helm chart that is part of the config map and perform the update for us. There we go. We can see that it's picked up our Documentum server and is going to terminate the pod right now that has been running. And it'll update the container with the information from the new image and redeploy the chart. So in the meantime, let's have a look at what the pods are doing right now within the system. Here you can see that the previous termination of the Documentum server has completed. We have our Documentum server. The container is now being created from the image. Typically this process takes about five minutes. 